Jim, I want to ask you for something like this, which really rotted, rotted. Um, you replace it, right? You replace it um, until the woods sound again. Or would you go maybe a little bit more like a foot um, or a few inches past the rotted? Um, there was a small area that we patched like this, but it wasn't in that miter and it was pretty small. So we just patched it with Bondo, but I did hear that there's an epoxy based wood filler that has a better lifespan. So I'm wondering what you think about that. Um, you can see all oh, the siding I'm noticing. There's a lot of caulking that had split. Seems like gap. I was wondering if that's something too that we should be on top of. Um, oh, here's a fascia from another building. Um, it looked like they had replaced it at some point because it's short at both ends, but also the caulking felt. So I thought it looked rotted from below, but it felt fine to me. So I'm just going to get it painted. This is a carpenter bee hole. Um, I'd like to get patched, but I curious if you had anything to say on that. Um, I did find this one lip on the rubber seam. I'll find somebody to glue back down and clean. Um, this one was odd. I was thought it was a really janky way to put the gutter, but um, somebody had written caulk on it, so it caught my eye. But I'm wondering if that is the way I should have somebody caulk it back again. Um, I'm sorry, I just missed that last video, but you could see that the the fascia was, was cracked. Um, I was wondering how on top of it we should be on the painting. Should we not let it get cracked like that? I am noticing it. In the other corner. Um, on a lot of the roofs. Um, yeah. There's a scupper drain. I don't see too many issues here. Oh, these scupper drains. Um, water damage. Are the closest thing that I could see that are causing this. That one didn't look so bad, but another building you could see underneath the tile. And that one, I don't know if you could tell, there were a couple of cracks inside. So we're assuming that people were using their water hose to clean their lanai, and it was making its way down um, into the building. And so you can't, I didn't show it in this video, but this soffit below is like that drywall had just crumbled in this corner, um, which is an easy fix, but I was kind of surprised to see that those, the fash had been affected. And maybe that was just, it gets its own weathering and rain from the outside and the moisture so close to it, it kind of compounds it. Um, yeah, curious what you think on all this.